Thanks for checking out 28 and Under 8. So this will be a fun series, 28 days of workouts all under eight minutes. What we're going to do is we're going to take four weeks, weeks one and three, we're going to take body part specific workouts, chest, back, shoulders, legs, etc. And then weeks two and four, we're gonna take upper, lower, core, cardio. You will see a difference if you stick to all 28 of these workouts. These make great additions to any Soul Strength Fit faith-based workout. Or if you're just tight on time, go ahead and just get one of these workouts in. If you're feeling like a superstar, double it, and then you'll get 16 minutes of a body of a body-specific focused workout. So day one, today we're focusing on chest. I want you to have a heavy set of dumbbells. These are all home workouts. I got out my equipment. And today for my chest workout, I'm gonna use 15s. So you get what you feel would challenge you for your chest, or just make it the heaviest dumbbells you've got at home. And what we're going to do is we will cycle through our exercises in 30 second intervals. And I will keep the workout to under eight minutes. Are you ready to get started? So have your equipment handy. We're gonna move fast. So try to stay with me and let's just get this done. Timer is about to start. And we are going to begin with laying chest press. So go ahead and lay back two 90 degree angles and let's get this going. So we're just warming up our chest right now. I want you to tap your elbows all the way to the ground. Get these elbows all the way together at the top of the movement, right above your chest. You can kind of keep a nice, strong, steady pace. Start to fatigue your muscles right away. It is only eight minutes, right? So you can do this for eight minutes. Keep this going. After this, we're gonna flip over and we're gonna take push-ups. So I'm still gonna consider that we're warming up. So let's take these on our knees, flip over, no time to spare. Three, two, one, here we go, knee push-ups. So just try to get in as many repetitions as you can in these 30 seconds. Try to get as big a range of motion as you can. Because we're doing this so back to back, you should already be feeling this through your chest and your arms. You have just about 10 seconds left on this interval and then we're flipping back over for another round of chest press. In four, three, two, and one, done. Okay, now this time with chest press, I'm going to give you the option to add a reverse crunch. So start with everything lifted. Now tap your heels, drop your elbows, right through center, lift. Tap and lift. So now we're just adding a little extra something to make it a little harder because why not? When we have multiple things going at the same time, it's gonna challenge your body more. So keep this going. After this, we're back over. Flipping back and forth, back and forth. We're almost done with the set. Keep it going, rep it out right here. Just a few more seconds and done. All right, Whew. flip over. Now we're taking a push up with a front reach. On your knees or on your toes, you're gonna drop into your push up, reach forward. Drop it down, and big reach. So, this is fine on your knees as well. Drop it down, and big reach. You're just shifting side to side. We're gonna flip over again, and we're gonna find one more variation on that chest press in just a second. Three, two, one, done. Okay, flip over. This time, we're gonna alternate our arms. So. We can start up, one taps down, and then the other. Just keep this going. So as one is lowering, one is lifting. Now, I am feeling these 15 pounds right now. Whatever you're using, I hope that you're feeling it by this point in the workout. Keep this going, one's lifting, one's lowering. Nice, steady, and controlled. Almost there, we're flipping over again for a push up to a down dog reach next. So I'll show you how you can do this on your knees. No problem, from your knees, you're gonna take a push up, push all the way back, down dog, reach for your opposite ankle, drop right back down, knee push up, down dog, reach. Otherwise, from your toes, push up to reach. You just have 10 seconds left on this exercise. So stay with it. Almost there. You're down to five, four, three, two, 
and done. Wow, okay, flip over again. This time we're moving into flies. You could switch to a lighter weight for flies. Maybe I should. We're gonna open up wide, like you're holding a big beach ball, and then squeeze through center. Bring these dumbbells together above your chest. So now we're moving to flies, and we have three sets of flies. We're going to superset these with plank hold push-ups. You are going to love it. This is going to finish out our chest workout. Keep this going. Almost done with this first set of flies. Done. Okay, set them down. I want you to meet me in a high plank. High plank hold. Four, three, two, one, four push-ups. Four, three, two, one plank hold, 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 four, three, two, one, three push ups. Three, two, one plank hold, 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 don't drop it. Four, three, you should be shaking. Two, one, give me two push ups. Two, one, ooh, that's it on time. Flip over, flies. Second set. You only have three sets of these. Get set up. Here we go. Open. And close. Nice job. So catch your breath here. Those plank hold push ups were tough. They weren't tough. I don't know. You're strong. Good for you. <laughs> but keep these going. Let's try to burn out our chest in eight minutes right now. It's hard to do because your chest is a big muscle, but you should be feeling this. Almost done with these flies, and then just one more set of flies after this. Keep it going, keep it going. Done. All right. Knee you back in a high plank. Get there to your high plank. Three, two, one. Hold the high plank. Four, three, two, one, four push ups. Four, three, two, one. Hold your high plank. Four, three, two. Okay, give me three push ups. Drop to your knees if you need. Three, two, one high plank. You're on your knees. Find your high plank. Just hold right here. This is it. Just for five seconds. Just hold, hold, hold. Almost done. Three, two, one. All right, let's finish this out. You have one more time through with flies and one more time through with those plank push up holds. And here we go. You can keep your feet down or up. And we are just moving right back to those flies. Finish out this workout. My upper body is fatigued. And yours should be as well. If not, next time try heavier weights, if you have them. If not, maybe it's time to order yourself some heavier weights. Keep this going. You're almost done, almost done. Almost there. Three, two, one, done. Flip over. This is it. Find that high plank. And hold. Hold right here. Four, three, two, one, four push ups. On your toes or on your knees. Four, three, two, one. Get back to that plank. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Just four, three, two, one, three push ups. On your toes or your knees. Doesn't matter. Go for it. Three, two, one. Just hold right here. Three, two, one. Okay, seriously, my arms are shaking at the end. I hope you felt that. I hope you enjoyed that quick eight minute workout. Tomorrow, we will get to back. So good job on day one in 28 and under eight. I'll see you tomorrow.